Trump Watch, Tuesday, June 6, 2017. There's a division in American politics today between, on one side, minorities who, for obvious reasons, including the president's insults of them during last year's campaign, detest him. And on the other side, working class white people who love Donald Trump because he stands against what many of them see as the politically correct establishment. Well, this is where things stand right now. We all know that. Go into a big city neighborhood and you'll find people who despise Trump. Go to a small town far from the city and you'll probably find a lot of people who root for Trump, all the harder the more the media go after him. Well, today's a year shy of a half century since we've seen an American leader who worked desperately and with real compassion to earn the respect of both groups, minorities and working class whites. Others have tried it, of course, but Robert Kennedy tried it the hardest. He refused to look down on one group so he could allow the other to rise. You could see it in the faces and the salutes of those along the rail tracks when he was taken to Arlington National Cemetery 49 years ago. People looked at him as a patriot, one who has kept faith with the country's greatest values. I've spent the last couple of years studying the life of Robert Kennedy. The result? Bobby Kennedy, a raging spirit, will be out this November. I think it's the story we need today more than ever because it's about bringing the country's working families together, not at war with each other. It's a story of the kind of leader we need but don't have, not now. That's hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.